Hello, I'm Paul Sparks, and you've got Juvenile Diabetes Awareness. I was diagnosed uh, with juvenile diabetes when I was in my late 20s, about 13 years ago. Type 1 diabetes is a little bit different than type 2 diabetes. Your autoimmune system kind of goes crazy and kills these things called beta cells, which are made in your pancreas. And beta cells make insulin, and insulin reacts with the food that you eat and sort of sends the good stuff to the cells and the bad stuff away and this gets fouled up and so you stop making insulin and so you have to take insulin daily for me it's about four or five times a day uh, in order to live i think if you talk to a doctor that a doctor would say the best thing you can do is have a lot of consistency in your life but unfortunately because i'm an actor and because my schedule changes constantly um, and because i am a father consistency is one of the things that that I don't get a lot of. And I think that makes things a little bit more difficult. I work with uh, JDRF, which is the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. A lot of their money and research goes into people just living with it. I have a continuous glucose monitor, which sort of monitors my blood sugar level at all times, which is this sort of new, wonderful thing that um, people are finding and I think is really helping them. Um, that I got from the JDRF, and I'll just tell you that, you know, that one little bit of information has completely changed my life.